I'm in a little town just above Scranton, Pennsylvania this morning. I'm here to check out the Archbald Pothole, which of course is in Archbald, Pennsylvania, in the Archbald State Park. And they've got some cool hiking trails, but that will be for another time. Let's go check out this pothole. This, uh, this pothole was discovered in 1884 by coal miners. They were working a seam of coal 45 feet under the ground. They fired a blast and an out came an outpouring of stones and water came rushing into the mine at them and of course they panicked. They thought they were going to be crushed and killed. They went running out of the mine. They had unknowingly uncorked from between 800 and 1,000 tons of smooth, round, and oval stones that were filling up this pothole. The pothole's pretty big. It measures 38 feet deep, and at one spot, it's 24 by 42 feet wide. The land owner, Colonel C.B. Hackley, built a fence and a wall around it, and it received a lot of attention, and a dedication ceremony was held in 1887. The geologists were trying to explain how the pothole had formed. They proposed it was carved by a waterfall falling through a crevice or a crack in a glacier. And a lot of the modern day geologists uh, still support this original theory. I mean, this happened about 20,000 years ago by a powerful whirling mixture of frigid glacial water, sand, and stones, and it wore away the solid rock forming the pothole. You know, kind of how the, the water and all that is uh, wearing away at Niagara Falls, you know. A uh, recent addition to the hypothesis places a lake on top of the glacier which provided a long-term supply for the waterfall to carve this out and other geologists uh, propose that there was no waterfall. They argue that a large, fast-moving stream under the glacier supplied the swirling water that created the pothole. In either case, it's a world-class pothole, but you know, even though they have a fence around it and signs and everything else, I mean the vandals still manage to get down there and cause lasting damage, which at some day, the pothole will look much different, I'm sure, because of all that. But it's a cool little spot to check out. Well, that's all for this little side trip. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you soon.